Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another installment of Reborn Gaming. I am your host, Mr. Dark. And... Dude, what's your problem? You, like, you see him shrugging his shoulders, kind of like, eh, whatever. <laughs> and welcome back to Final Fantasy XV <laughs> with your host, Mr. Dark, and all that. Oh, so, in the last episode, sorry about that, in the freaking last episode, we were going to, um, we got another weapon of the king, and we went through our first dungeon, which was completely surreal, but, um, for now, we're gonna go ahead and take a drive to our next location. I mean, um, what's the closest one? That could be for parking spot. I'm going all the way over there. Come on. I, I said quest location. Go to the freaking quest location. Man. Ugh. The crystal, the source of magic and prosperity in Lucius. It is prophesied that when darkness threatens the world, the crystal will choose its champion. Well, here I we like are. that con. Thank you, Ignis. I really like the whole concept of Final Fantasy and the crystals. I always thought that was really cool. I mean, it's a, it's a trademark for Final Fantasy, and I guess maybe a lot of fantasy titles in general, but still, Final Fantasy had the whole crystal thing down on lock. Alright, um, so in this episode, I'm going to try to do just a side quest real quick and then go back onto the main story, so that way we don't divulge too much. And I actually heard that apparently... Hello? Interesting. I actually heard that you Knock. could go... Overhead! What? Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. Well, that happened. Things are getting interesting. Guess they're letting out some soldiers or some mechs or anything like that. Let's go around. Oh shit, there's a lot of soldiers over there. Um, I'm only going around because the mark is there, but there's a wall. Are you telling me there's a dead end over this way? Uh, yeah, there's a dead end. Um. Huh. Interesting. Man, where to go? Who knew Kor was such a badass? I'm just glad he's on our side. Yeah, I will say Cory is pretty fucking awesome with his katana wielding skills. Remind me of Virgil from uh, Devil May Cry, the the third one. Oh, there was a little space in between here. Sorry about that. But um, uh, we're quick before we. Oh, oh, we're hiding. Hi. From here, we will split into two groups. Uh huh. Prince Noctis, please join the marshal up ahead. The rest of you will assist me in the diversionary effort. Oh, that's just me and Cora, huh? Yeah, that's fine. Well, see you guys later. You it go is. give them hell. We'll do the same on our end. Alright. I'm on my own this time around. Let's do this. But yeah, um, I will say, I am a bit curious. Now, I had mentioned in the past episode or two that there is a possibility of getting the Ultima Blade in the, um, as early as Chapter 3, and I found the method to do so. So I'll actually make it a point to do that once we get to Chapter 3, and apparently, it's just a level fucking 30 around that time. I was, I'm not complaining or anything like that. Hey, Core. Once we're in, we launch our ambush, pushing out while support pushes in, crushing the enemy from both sides. Okay, god damn, Core. There's all types of health going on. Okay. Okay, now it's, uh, this is going to drive me up the wall. Like I said, this doesn't seem Final Fantasy-ish. Oh, we're in? No, okay. All right. There you go. Katana 
I'm actually gonna go boss a booty on these asses! Oh, I like annihilate them. We good? Let's go. Oh, there's one other one. Oh! Bitch, please. It's a little easier with core around. Don't get used to it. I'll be gone before you know it. Right? Enjoy it while I can. Above us. Got it. Okay, hold on a second. Let me see if this helps. Yeah! Fire in the hole! Okay, this is not good. I'm getting, like, pissed on. I'm trying to get up there! God damn it! Thank you! Oh, there we go! So fucking annoying! Hold on. Got it. Okay, we're good. I am not getting finesse on this one. Shit. Walk through the park. So it should be. Otherwise, it'll look in everyone's way. Could have gone it alone if I wanted. That was mentality. Will the others be all right on their own? Worry will only compromise your focus. Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't do this on my own. I'm still, uh, new to this game. Open up. Open test me. Hello? Oh, hi! Switch! Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, wait. Switch! Continue the hunt. Wait, is this where? No, I came in from the side. Okay. Muscle stimulant or stimuli? Hmm, interesting. A lot. Hmm, I thought I'd never. Guess not. Whee! Okay, what you got for me, game? Oh. Not. Hey, bro. Marshall. Oh shit. It's good to see you again. The whole ride on your end? Right as rain. The Nifs couldn't take their eyes off us. Thanks to you, we were spared their attention. Yes. Oh. Do we have company? Stay I feel right like we're where you are. What? Hello? Well, well, if it isn't Kor the Immortal. Huh? So, you survived the Citadel. But you won't survive what I have in store for you. It's past time your legend came to an end. What? Do we know who that is? He seems like a badass. Ow. Ow. Magic tech armor. Wait, the music for this is so awesome. What's the plan, Ignis? Prepare ourselves for the long haul. Get up, walk right first! It's over. Oh. Okay! The fucking wreck! Okay! Oh! The enemies in this one are very tiny! 
They're eating the handle for for them. Holy shit! The the music is amazing, though. Oh. oh. No! Okay, um... Get yeah, this up. Okay, take me out the other sniper. How did my health go down so quick? Gosh damn! puts my mind at ease. It's clear I don't need to worry anymore. I'll return to watching the NIFs. Till next time, take care. Where for? Continue on. Wait a minute. Was it the wife you on this road? Ain't so bad out here once you get used to it. Still a lot we yeah, haven't right? seen, though. And a lot for us to do. <sighs> yeah. Buck up. We're just getting started. Yeah. That's <sighs> <laughs> so all you have to do is like, eh. Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> oh, end of chapter. We're, we're in chapter three already. Okay. I can play, but oh, okay. Uh, picture, nah. Yeah, we're gonna have to. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save this one here. Uh, let's uh, save this guy. Save this guy. Oh, that's a beauty. Oh, look at Core being a badass. Yes, yes, I need this all of my life. And I need all of that in my life. I need all of that in my life. Because of this now. Okay. <laughs> man, oh man. From now, we're at chapter three. And the open world. 
The Empire is a powerful foe, and Noctis has far to travel before he can hope to reclaim the crystal. He sets out across new lands to search for the power of his forebear. So now we're in Chapter 3. Woo! Okay. So that means we're going to go ahead and be able to get the ultimate weapon of this chapter. So, I'll be... No, wait, you know what? It's almost finished loading up, so... We'll see what happens next. Yeah, I know actually what to do to be able to get to... To get the ultimate weapon, but I have to be at, like, level 30 for what I understand. So, that sounds like, for me, it's going to be a whole lot of, you know, side-questing crap that's going to end up having to happen. Maybe, maybe I'll look up a couple of guides... See how you, you know, you level up and grind and things. That way, you guys will have to go ahead and bear the stupidity that is the level grind. So, uh, anytime that game, the loading screens are going to take you forever, you know. And I don't want to go ahead, and I don't want to leave here. I'm sorry we're not, you know, you have to listen to my voice all much longer. But I don't want to go into the new chapter and then... It not have... So, oh, there we go. The prince eludes death. Yeah. And what of the elusive ring? I don't know. Eluna Freya know. has absconded with it. Find and kill her. <clears throat> the ring is the final piece. Looks like our king. We may oh. do well to take her alive. The six wield power beyond our imagination. Hmm. The Oracle holds the key for the king. Jesus. She could unlock many secrets. Nay, High Commander. Huh. Lord Ravis, the Imperial Army is now at your disposal. That guy that these are all A moot okay. point, while the fugitives remain at large. My men and I will continue our search for the Prince and the Oracle. So glorious. My crystal. This is the, I was about to say, like, was it going to be like a sad shot to where the crystal was? Hey, we're back! Look out, world. Here we come. Yes. So we can finally leave this dust bowl behind. The lands beyond are vast by comparison to lead. Bigger's better. More stuff to see and do. Mm. First comes to Sky, a region known for its wetlands. Really? Wetlands? <laughs> There's also a chocobo forest. <laughs> now we're talking! Further west lies the Clane region, wherein we'll find the town of Lestalum. Oh, isn't that where Iris is headed? Barring delays, she should have arrived by now. Maybe even had herself a look at the meteor. The meteor of the Six? Same, its heat is harnessed to power the Stalum. Whoa, that sounds way cool. I'm actually looking forward to this. The six, if I remember correctly, are the summons in this game. It'll so be that's a long drive. For. Best fill up the tank before we set out. But the tank is good. I believe we have a solid lay of the land now. The driver's seat is yours, Noct. If you so desire it. I have all the control. Cause I'll drive the car whenever he wants. Sweet. So now we are in the open world, baby. Ah. Let's let's go and crawl out a little bit. Be? Oh, hold on. I wanna look at the weather. Hello? Um, not? Iris? Iris? It's really you. So good to hear your voice. Everything's fine over here. We managed to make it to Lestalem. Oh nice. We just settled into our new digs. So yeah. Let me know when you're coming so we can meet up. Party! Yeah. Will do. You better. Burden of expectation. Was that Iris? <laughs> Iris is just, Can't sister. even call her yeah. own brother. In all right? fairness, yours wasn't the obituary broadcast all over Lucius. What about Fair. me? She say anything about me? Yes, dude. What's up? What's up, Propto? Did you see that sign? Chocobos! Chocobos! Yeah. Well, no time for that. Need to get to Lestalem. No, no, it's still wait. ages away. Come on, just a quick visit. No, no, no. We can go to the Chocobos. We can go to the Chocobos. It's fine. It's fine. Take a break. Sure. Let's check it out. Yes! Gonna be awesome. Reds of a feather. No, we can go check out Chocobos. Why, why not? They're fucking 
UFOs. They're awesome. Let's go ahead and look at the weather. Oh my god. This scenery is freaking beautiful. Holy crap. And a per I think this is a perfect place to go and end the episode. I mean, I hate to do it and make the episode so short, but holy crap, look at it. And I don't want the episode to be running too long. We got other things we got to go ahead and record and all that stuff. So, I'm going to go ahead. You're going to go ahead and see some chocobos. That I will promise you. We will see some chocobos. But then after that, I am going to go ahead and break a little bit from the main line to go and do some side questing to level the crap out of these guys. Make them as strong as possible so we can rush, break, and do all kinds of awesome stuff through this game. So, until that point, thank you all so much for watching. If you like, comment, favorite, subscribe, it's going to help this channel grow just a little bit with your help. And until our next adventure, ladies and gents, this is your host, Mr. Dark. Signing off.